Saga of the Moon Priestess is a retro top-down action-adventure game inspired by the 8-bit and 16-bit gaming eras. The Kingdom of Lunaria is in jeopardy after a prince is kidnapped by an unknown assailant. In Lunaria's lively universe, players may explore five dungeons, acquire seven life containers, 15 unique items, and battle a variety of enemies. The game includes traditional adventure, a spear, equipment management, health upgrades, and homemade weaponry. In addition, players might get an advantage by using pebbles as improvised weapons. Epic Chef is a culinary adventure in which players take in the character of Zest, a chef tasked with creating delicious dishes using a dynamic recipe formulation system. They must participate in major cooking competitions to become the ultimate culinary champion. Zest must also practice sustainable living by planting vegetables and caring for animals. They must gather resources to build specialized equipment for refining substances and creating new recipes. The game allows you to explore the city's numerous services including bars, spas, and fishing, as well as engage with people. Melon Journey Bittersweet Memories is a narrative-driven adventure game that takes place in a pixel art realm full with eccentric people and lawbreakers. Players take on the role of Honeydew, a factory worker at a melon soda company looking for her lost best buddy. The game delves into the town's underbelly, requiring observational skills and fast thinking to understand the plot. The game's characters are quirky and have complicated backgrounds, each with their own distinct variations and sometimes tragic pasts. The game has a compelling jazzy lo-fi music. Obakaidoro is an entertaining game in which humans must work together to escape a monster in just three minutes. Players can participate in online or offline games with up to four others. The game provides an asymmetric action experience in which three humans confront a single monster. Players can participate in complex tactics or keep things light and entertaining. Humans can utilize their lantern attack to fight back against the monster, whilst monsters must perfect abilities such as glide and track to trap humans. Project Helios, a 1971 turn-based strategy game, combines current military strategies and violent combat. Set in a world with restricted weaponry and transportation, the game follows eight people as they create an alliance to find Dr. Margaret Blythe. Their voyage is filled with peril as they encounter raider attacks, military strongholds, and a terrifying anti-technology cult. They fight intense fights, form relationships, and reveal secrets. Each character's strategic and personal actions will lead them to one of three possible endings, making every step critical in their survival. A tragedy ravaged a kingdom, leading to lies and backstabs. The king's magic was used to take away people's capacity to speak, and he was thrown into the abyss. The princess, his daughter, was imprisoned in a crystal tar drop. Seven rainbow-colored lights emerged from the abyss years later, becoming seven heroes. When the princess called for assistance, seven heroes appeared, each with their own combat technique. Players can select from a number of characters, including wanderer, archer, and warrior, and spend crystals to transfer between them or return to base camp. Cat Quest II is a 2D open-world action RPG set in a fantasy world populated by cats and dogs. Players must restore their thrones as Feeling Guard and Lupus, two kings facing forth against the Lupus Empire. Game includes a unique cooperative element, allowing players to explore the kingdoms alone or with pals. The Gentle Bros have introduced additional elements such as explosive spells, weaponry, character switch mechanics, and local co-op action. The game also includes a variety of dungeons and side missions, resulting in an amazing cat adventure. Ryumu and Marissa must solve riddles in order to restore harmony. They return Sumireko home, wreaking mayhem in both Gensokyo and the Outer World. Key elements include skilled fighting methods, 
a personalized gaming experience and the opportunity to overcome problems by modifying abilities, attributes, and playstyles. Players can experiment with various weapons, armor, and accessories to improve their fighting effectiveness and gain an advantage in battle. The game provides players with a unique and entertaining experience. Roguebook is a roguelike deck-building game created by Faria and Richard Garfield. Players may unleash lethal combinations, battle legendary opponents, and select from a massive collection of 200 cards. Players may level up their heroes, gain new skills, and travel through 20 rigorous difficulty levels. The game is endlessly replayable, allowing players to experiment with different combinations and strategies. Roguebook is an exhilarating experience in which every decision counts and strategic thinking is imposed. This retro-inspired action platformer pits you against scary monsters in violent skill-based combat. Players can use numerous killing devices and powers to put their skills to the test against towering monsters. A warped Lovecraftian realm with Metroidvania-style adventure and gothic aesthetics is included in the game. Players may personalize their fighting experience by changing the look, abilities, characteristics, and weaponry of their character. Exploration loot and fallen enemy loot may be utilized to enhance weapons through crafting. When a viral epidemic happens at the first research center, Steve awakens from his cryogenic pod to find himself stuck in a living hell surrounded by zombies. Despite the horrible reality looming, he must battle his way out. Exploration, action, riddles, and resource management are all hallmarks of the traditional survival horror genre. The game has a higher production value with improved visuals and effects, as well as a 10-hour adventure. To solve puzzles and increase their inventory, players can acquire and combine items. In order to fight Capital B and conquer the impossible lair, players must travel a succession of 2D levels, a puzzling overworld, and recruit the Royal B Talion. The game includes visually appealing locations, personalities such as Yoka and Laylee, and a diverse array of friends and opponents. The overworld acts as a major hub for level transitions and provides an immersive gameplay experience, allowing players to explore, fulfill goals, rescue royal bees, and find valuable items. The game features various level states, which allow players to influence the environment and face new difficulties. Become a gladiator. Story of a Gladiator is a game in which players take on the role of a guy who has experienced great casualties in the conflict with the Roman Empire. He wanders Rome, looking for a purpose and wondering why the gods have spared his life. He ultimately discovers his fate in the Colosseum, but must accept this new route. Players must acquire combat methods, confront over 80 opposing gladiators and 20 beasts, and fight three bosses in 36 encounters over three arenas. It can even invoke heavenly intervention by praying to the gods while fighting. Go against the Roman Empire and its champions. As an unpaid student in Neo-Cascadia, you must fight against bankrupt companies and their employees who are doomed to roam the hallways forever. You must discover the underlying motivations of Fizzle, a fizzy drink firm and cubicle, a subscription box producer with delivering drones. Knowing Under's dungeons provide a variety of weaponry, but they can shatter at any time. The bosses are cursed entrepreneurs who make rich from investments as their workforce battle amongst themselves. Defeat them and return with their enchanted treasures to boost the business. Batora Lost Haven is a choice-driven RPG experience with a distinct duality system that influences battle, plot, conversation, puzzles, and endings. Players must travel diverse alien planets and uncover a cosmos with hazy morality and resort thin distinctions between right and bad. After losing her family, Avril must travel across the globe to learn ancient truths and make life-changing decisions. The game has a multi-layered battle system that requires players to use the twin powers of the sun and moon and select their route with several endings. 